Military operations are becoming more of a joint effort, so conducting joint training is important to enhancing readiness. For the first time, air traffic controllers from U.S. Army Garrison Humphreys trained with the Air Force on Osan Air Base. So the Army and the Air Force are doing joint training with each other. Uh, the Air Force mainly controls fixed wing and the Army controls mainly rotary wing, so we're getting a little bit of both and we're able to integrate that with each other. A major difference between the two services is while the Air Force is more permanently fixed, the Army is more tactical with their mobile systems. When we do forward deploy, the initial flow of forces will be mixed rotary wing and fixed wing aircraft. And predominantly, the Army has only been given a chance to train with rotary wing aircraft. And this provides them the opportunity to get that good experience that they can take downrange whenever it's called upon. Reporting from Osan Air Base, I'm Airman Giancarlo Carter.